Oui, si vous dites que vous avez dit 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 la localisation, la localisation à MCD. Dans ce cas, la politique de, de localisation de Kubanita qui Mozilla, Brelavel, Amoha, Sir, Asksem Zouaron, Seigneur Ejef, Siglizetaka, Ardine, Zanouat Nitsar, ou Dachou, et les Souir, nous sommes ici, la localisation. Jeff, uh, just briefly, I introduced you and why we are looking for an interview with you since we did already one with your colleague from France, Alexandre uh, Lissi. So the reason why that, because you are the head of localization at Mozilla, can you tell us more about what is, uh, can provide the localization service at Mozilla? Yeah, absolutely. So to, just to take a, a step back a little bit, um, localization in general, it, it's important to have a, an understanding of, of localization in general before talking about um, Mozilla specifically. Um, localization is all about taking software, whether that be a web app, whether that be a piece of desktop software or a mobile app, and customizing it to the unique needs of a particular market and the users in that market. Now that broad definition can include the actual translation of, of user interface elements. It can include the ability to type and put in specific characters unique to a language. It can include even voice commands uh, or legal restrictions or requirements. It can even go as far as altering the, the display of the particular piece of software so that it functions in a right to left manner or a left to right manner, or even has a different color palette that is more reflective of not only the, the message and the symbols that the company wants to send to their users in that region, but colors that users in that region will respect and interpret those symbols as having those meanings. Um, within Mozilla, we focus on trying to make the web accessible to anybody and eliminating language as a barrier to entry for people to access the web. Uh, so we focus on localizing uh, Firefox for desktop as well as Firefox for Android and iOS. Uh, we also focus to uh, localize our Mozilla.org page so that our values and our mission are publicly accessible and on display in many, many languages. Um, and we do this through largely the goodwill and uh, contributions of volunteer communities all around the world. Uh, thank you, Jeff. Uh, 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 if you don't mind, I'm going to translate briefly what did you say. Should you know, Jeff, that Jeff, that can is we are going to company that can Mozilla, that can bring it fuck a can all alone and I scan so if you if scan a disuti is Francis. It could lay in a can a glen of mother, you can have some mother like your own brain. موزيان سعر طاسة كثير نفشكا أم ويب ماستر مقام فايرفوكس سعر غني المقام سيستم ديكسبورتاسيون فايرفوكس أوبيريتين سيستم يكو كثير إيز مرت يكو تلاين بس خدمت وكنير هذا الحوت غرزات شكير يوين سرير سكسي وسين أنظر هذا شو إيه تخمين مكان جاف كنير أنظر نكون سيقبليا 
دوك ما ظل كي كيرا تشكو تقبل لي تكشم مليح وكيرا سنين سنين تجميل طاس طاس كيما تما هو تما تما يقبلي نقدم كلا دغا محمد والقاسم سليمان اميري زويلي كنت نجمان لي تموت تجميل تسم طوال اشكو تكشم مليح تقبل لي تقلال لنا كي الموزيات واش سكسير كيما تما جات التينير هذا شو تنا كان انو نلقى سورانسيس لي كريتير اي جنتو سلاي تكا ثمانيو تتكشم تقول لنا كي لا لوكاليزاسيون نا ام سوذاك نا موزيا جيف ذا فولوين كويشن از اف يو اف يو كان جيف اس وات ار ذا كريتيريا داز موزيلا لوكاليزاسيون تيم يوز تو اوبن لوكاليزاسيون فور a new language uh, knowing that the kabil language is already there that's a that's a really great question um when really what it comes down to is whether there is a community that can support the localization effort um we don't have a history of going out and doing outreach to communities around the world and asking them to come and donate their time. Uh, instead, communities tend to approach us. Uh, so that would be probably the first piece of criteria. We, we're not going out looking for communities. We're, we have an open invitation to communities to come and participate. Um, once they make a request and ask to, to begin localizing, we work with them on a couple of different levels. Uh, we take a look at and ask them questions around uh, the number of people that are going to be supporting the localization effort as part of that community. Uh, we ask what their interest is in what product they specifically are the most passionate about localizing. Uh, we also have some product management like criteria where we ask questions around, you know, a, a great example of a past language that we we um, shipped in a, in a few years ago is Guarani. Guarani is a, a language that is spoken in Paraguay in South America, as well as um, Bolivia. And when they approached us, they first wanted to localize Firefox desktop. When we made them aware that that actually was a very large project and looking at the device distribution and device usership of people in Paraguay, we instead recommended that they start localizing an Android browser or because the predominance of Android smartphones on the market in Paraguay was so much bigger than the, than laptops and desktop computers. Um, so we work with the communities to try to identify the, the lowest hanging fruit opportunity and the one that they can count as a win more quickly. Now, some communities, they're, they're insistent on I don't care about that product. I care about this product and this is what I want to localize. And if that's the case, as long as they have people and they understand the expectations and, and what uh, amount of time they should expect it takes to, for example, ship Firefox desktop, um, then we proceed to, to onboard them into our translation management system, Pontoon. Uh, we work with them to create style guides. We work with them to create terminology resources um, some of that setup within Pontoon requires knowledge of specific plural forms and plural rules um, and identifying the right locale code for that language, the right language name, making sure that there's data in the Unicode Common Locale Database Repository. Um, and once all of that has been established, we turn everything on in Pontoon and the community and the volunteers are able to enter and begin translating. Uh, thank you, thank you, Jeff. Uh, we're going to translate it again. We did it in the future. We did it in the future. We did it in the in نكون نعم تساوون تثلاين يساعد في كوميونتي نا إمزداريس نا أغرافي جلان سفيرنسيت ما إلا نفكد نتساعد عني نفوس نتل التيران دي نوحة الزافي هكا دي كل شغالات نكون نعم نتساكن تموس نعم نوع تتكنيكي وكنعم أذا تسلحو 
what are the motivations or what motivates uh, this openness uh, to all the languages over the world uh, is this uh, is it uh, the recruitment of contributors and users for mozilla products to enlarge the population of uh, uh, mozilla users or the desire to offer uh, projects to allow uh, languages such as uh, kabir to survive over the world what will be the your, your answer of this question the the primary motivator behind our our level of openness is philosophical um and ideological we believe firmly that the internet is a global public resource and as such it should be open and it should be accessible um firefox and, and browsers being the vehicle by which people access the internet are really the first line of defense or the first the first pieces of software that people encounter when trying to use the internet. And so in our mind, in order to ensure that the internet remains open, we also need to produce a browser that has a compelling enough usability for people uh, that reflects that openness uh, that we, we want to see the internet become. So we linguistic access is one of our highest priorities due to the fact that it is a core component of our mission. It, one of the side benefits of that is that it creates a space for communities that are either under-resourced or aren't represented, underrepresented in the online ecosystem to come in and create that representation for themselves uh, through localizing Firefox and localizing other products. Um, so certainly we care and we monitor and see what uh, how our market share is in different parts of the world and we care about number of users but our, our primary driving motivation is all around eliminating barriers to entry for the web because we believe that the web is useful for everyone oh thank you thank you jeff uh jeff bt اشعاليه <تصفيق> وتجناتو تلاقينا هذا الحوت ديال الانترنت ناو تجنا الباضي غرفان وكتشمنا الانترنت شكون وسينتنا وسينتنا تلاقينا كيف يتجدد لنا كاكيا نبغى نتكتب نيت بوزيا ايوا كنا اسمغون ثلاث سن سود من الانترنت ودارني وكنا اسندي صح امتكان تسمقولن 
لانترنت ستوت ليتنسن ذا شكينا غيا وين تسكسي غيدي تدون تيدينا ديما سقبيلي تقولا تدانا غاستيكليزيت ولكن نبغى نزانسي جاف بيتي ذا شو يعويق اني زمنا ديالين يكرا توت ليني وكنا داك الشمن نقول لنا كي موزيلا تيدينا غاستيكليزيت جاف Can you tell us uh, what are the concerns or technical constraints for a certain minority language, if we can say that, languages uh, to integrate certain uh, uh, Mozilla uh, projects? Which and what are the solutions to Romidae uh, uh, problems? There are, there are a wide range of concerns um, and, and even constraints in some cases. Um, as far as technical constraints are concerned, for the actual process of localizing the software into X un under-resourced language, um, there first needs to be certain data around that locale that Firefox or whatever other product can process. That type of data is, for example, time formatting, number formatting, dates, date formatting, currency, um, ensuring that the script can actually be visible and rendered properly. Uh, all of that is governed by a body called Unicode. And they have what is known as the CLDR, which contains, it's a database effectively, a database repository that contains a lot of that information. They, their whole goal is to collect that data for every language in the world. Uh, but it's it's an ongoing iterative process. So sometimes we'll have a community approach us that says we want to localize Firefox and we'll go to look in the Unicode database and find that there's no uh, locale information, no data for that language. So we will have to actually create that data and store it in Firefox and find some way to submit it upstream to Unicode so that it can be incorporated there. The value of having it incorporated in Unicode is that when Apple or when Google or some other company decides we want to expand into this market and localize our products into this language, they'll be using that same data that is stored in Unicode in order to make that localization possible. Um, so Unicode support, that that's probably the biggest technical constraint. As far as process and product are concerned, um, we do have concerns and we keep these in mind when onboarding a new language uh, around the right product for the users in that market. We recognize that volunteers are coming to us and giving their time and their talents to Mozilla. We want to make sure that whatever their offering that to whatever product they dedicate their at that time to can have a far reaching impact on their community. Um, that the example I gave with Guarani, you know, about identifying the opportunity uh, between desktop users and mobile users in that country that presented to us the, the notion that if they started with Android, that would have, so that would cast the widest net and they have the greatest impact on their local community. So we try to keep that in mind and we recognize that there are in for some, especially for some under resourced languages, there are infrastructure concerns, infrastructure issues, uh, specifically internet infrastructure issues um, that make either localizing the software difficult because we use a web based, a cloud based platform to do that. Um, or even just make it makes it difficult to use the internet in general, even if they, they had Firefox as a browser. Um, so there are a number of, of concerns. The, the way to go about solving those is really to establish a better pipeline between communities that are contributing to Mozilla and Unicode. Um, that solves some of the technical constraints because if those communities can be empowered to contribute that data to Unicode, that opens so many more doors for localization for that particular community. Um, so one to do on our list uh, is to try to create that more seamless pipeline 
between or connection between communities and Unicode. So then we can consume that data and so can Apple and so can anyone else. Um, as far as the other concerns, we, we have to take different approaches. Um, we have to be tuned in to what the user trends are in a given country or a given region um, in order to make recommendations from the to the community. And very often we rely on the community because we know that you know best what, uh, what people do and how people behave in your part of the world. Um, we often rely on the community to indicate to us uh, the best path forward. Uh, thank you, Jeff. Uh, uh, I'm so glad كيكين <تصفيق> ذي توت لين كي ما تكش متكي ذاتي مينوثين ذاكن إلى إلى قيس في كان على الدنيا إلى قد تتوعون سيون سيوت نتلقى مثلاً مقام أونيكود يكد لين خير قبل أن زمان نظرة كفلي سخطة تلاقي قص تكنيكي ذيك صدق توت لين تكنيكي ذيك تان لانجاج تكنيكي إيوه عارف دين سمك كي 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 نسو متى ماشى أو نرجم أو نرجم ذاكن دليت سيارة نزات خيران تدويلين تسجيلين كذا ويجد يخدمن قص قلنا كي ومسير ذيك إلى دغام موحد والقسم الضمان كذا سليمان أميري كذا وياب هذه اللي تطلس دويلين غزاتي وكنيا هذا نسميك وش كده ناكي جيف بيتي ستجليزي ترى كم كان خطر شكرا تاني حنا ذي روحه جيف سينيا غاس كسي كنا نجيب ممكن نستخدم ذا شو إزمر لوصيات لوصيات إزمر أتفك وغرف قبيلي نار يتربعت تقبيلي نار المنقان كبيل فون تيم وكني السلحون أوهان اسم فارني ناس جيف ماي لاست كويشن what do you recommend for the كبيل فون تيم to go further on its localization project that's you know I, I don't know really that I have any solid recommendations. When, when I look at the activity that comes from the Kabil community, um, they are very thorough. Uh, they are very quick to react. And whenever a new product uh, or a new pr project is announced, they are among the first communities to raise a hand and volunteer to start localizing it. Um, we, we've really valued the high level of collaboration um, that we've had with the Kabyle community and are very pleased to, to have them involved, involved in this effort with us. So really just keep, maintain the status quo, keep being active, keep, uh, keep contributing. If there are opportunities in other areas that are not Mozilla, other open source areas, uh, to participate and continue the spread of the Kabil language, uh, take advantage of those as just as you have at Mozilla with the same level of, uh, of dedication and enthusiasm and passion. And uh, I think if they do that, we'll, we'll be seeing a lot more uh, Kabil representation in software and on the internet. Thank you, Jeff. Uh, before uh, coming to you for the last word, I would like to translate it in uh, كبي لانجويج كي عندي قارة يقبلية عندي صراحة تيري تكي نجرب بتير إنك بليه وصل شو اسمه نيرة تجربة تكي أنا تقبلية تكي لان ذا جمسي ذي يشكون على تجربة تكي صراحة نقص الطاس ولا شلل الموزيع دي دي نور فنانة بشكل نار نوتي عندنا تفضل تت جان إمزورة جان اللي كوميتي إمزورة من مظل إكت إكتزالني وكنتي ده رغف قبلية تخدم من القديش إيجر زنا قص الطاس ويبغات نسنمبر نسنمبر ويبغات نديني دعني كم نتكنا في الريدة كير ولاش وين اكن يفن كي كيري دو سارة تقرا اسكسيين فغات ساكاد كي نيون اسكسيين ويس ستا شكور اي نايدة كي كيرا خطنا تفرا نزرب كنا كي كيرا 
الانترفيو كي باسكو حنا غادي نروح باغي زينير ميلا ديال سواس ان دان زمن انا ديال الدين البنوات ديال الفريق ان دان تسمو الفرق بايلي تايلين تاتي لا لا ريبريزونطون في الفريق ماشي ماشي دي قامو تما دان ابيس تايكيا ماشي 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 يعني كوز ما خصك شي حاطو انتيرس هادي يعرفو لهم سلاي لكن كاين سينيا غادي ني اولي سنتا كيرا ثانك يو فيري ماتش جيف بيتي فور فور جيفين اس تيز Uh, time to answer our questions. Uh, uh, maybe just one last word before we close the interview. Yeah, um, no, I'm I'm very grateful to have have the chance. Any chance that I get to be able to share the, the accomplishments of our community of local of localizers, I try to jump on and and really take advantage. I have the privilege of working with some of the most passionate. And enthusiastic people around the world, um, and it's really an honor to have a platform to be able to share with the world more about the the contributions that they make and the impact that they have on the world and on their own communities. So thank you very much for having me. Thank you. We get to this one. I can't even believe it. I'm not sure if I'm going to show you the matas. The show that I can't even see the signal localization. It is just the matas. تمثال ناخذ سلاي انه مازال يفرحصون شي كيف قد ما كاينز هناك تلميه تميه دارضون ما كي دو سان نبني راني تا كيران تدويل تا كيان سي ان نوي تدويلين نيران تي كاز لا تراني شو تنا كل سنه تكنولوجي تشكون تقبلي تي بصد اللوان ديك راسك شي مازال كي عمرين لو موند نيميريك تي جنات الحو غير زات وتسعو امكاني زيان تو سلاي نيم فران تي بقاني دو مازال اي هي كي دو سان دي نقيمه ذي ثلويت